Hi, and welcome to the poster number 617. We are September 8, 2020, and I already imported the element I usually use for the poster of this mini series named Mental Process. Uh, it is the number 16 today. So let's type this little number there, verify that. That it is in the center of the canvas. And let's get started. Um, today, I will maybe use, oh, said maybe again. So I will use, I will use a color, but which one? Let's take a look at the color. And decide uh, yesterday I said I will create something with this light blue, but I'm not sure. Bright orange. Yeah, orange again. No. Darker orange, maybe not. Purple. Let's go for a um, blue purple. Um, purple more blue than red. There's too much red inside. Maybe there is too much blue. Not really. Let's use bright red. I like this color. Very aggressive. And I think it will be perfect. I need more. Let's use pink color. Bright pink. Yeah. Look good. I think it looks good. Yeah, it looks good. So, <clears throat> today I want I want to create something with gradient from this pin to nothing. Process. Process. Let's see what happens if I play with it in a horizontal way. Minus ninety degree. Yeah, come on. Let's place it. Oh. You have to take time to transform that. Really? That's kidding. Mental. Let's turn this one into a minus 90 degree too. 90 degree. <clears throat> Come on. No. Yeah. 90 degree.
Mm -hmm. That's a good idea. Come on, Bishop. It's very complicated just for that. Now it should be very easy. So come on. No, 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 no. Okay. Minus ninety. Go on. You, you are just do it. Okay. No, come on. I don't take that time to turn the text or move it. Window. Option. You show smart guides. Yeah, we are on why they don't show it. Why they don't show it. Here. Whoa. Let's duplicate it. Mental. Get rid of this one there. Mantle. Ah. Select the date and place it on the side of the canvas. That's minus 90. Yeah. Like this. You, you are fine. Make an empty area without the uh, layout there. I think it looks good. You are closed. Yeah. Your turn to move minus ninety. Okay, let's turn it. Okay. Oh, takes time. Takes time. Not possible. Process. Duplicate there and there. Cool. Let's place the Japanese font. Somewhere right here. Let's make that rectangle here and place the Japanese text somewhere here. Let's move that process up. I 
one more time with the checking spawn there. Like this. Um, let's uh, once more. Let's copy the Japanese font. Take a look there and make it set it with a, with a different weight I don't want no, it's not tracking there it's the leading I should change Okay, let's type it. I think around 200 would be okay. 200 pixel. Ah, 200, and we are done with that. Let's see what happens. Yeah, it looks okay. I'm allowed to comment in. Try to make it as large as well, or maybe more large. Contrast there, high contrast. Okay, like this. There. How it looks like. Maybe six hundred no nine hundred would be would be okay. Was there too much uh, leading I think there? Yeah that's that looks good enough. Let's change the color with the bright pink and see what happens. I'm curious what it looks like. It's the bright thing there. See it. Yeah, very, very eye catching. Let's try the light gray and see if it will be better. Yes, it is better now. Let's place it there too. Yeah. Now let's do something with the colors. With the color red. Uh, Rectangles there. Let's see this area of the space there. And place it behind the brand, of course, because it hides too much and it's not what I want to do there. Mm. Let's create a layer mask. Use the gradient tool. Set it. This black and white colors, basic, black and white, tone, and inside the layer mask, drag and drop, and drop the gradient. I use it the wrong side, side here. And it looks pretty good. I'm feeling more. Mm. 
No, no, it's the gradients are early is that. It should not do that. So let's set the Japanese Apollo in white color. I want to do some brushes. And I will use some brushes. Select the bright pink. Okay, this seems it's fine. One time there, then not correct. Yeah, very, very seen and uh, and light. Minus 90 again, there. Like this, it's fine. Let's create another bright rectangle very soon there. See what happens. Okay. Interesting. Make a smaller one there. Still very soon. Mm. It's weird with the girl. But I think it's okay. This is very small. Mental process. Wow. Let's use white brush. Just near and just behind the, the rectangle there. Here is something in the <coughs> like a brand effect. Okay, like this. It's a gray paint. But I want it in white, so I set in white. Okay. Yeah, B. And let's go to play with the brain. Create a layer mask because I am not so sure about how it would look like. Selection. I use another brush, a normal brush. I like painting black inside to hide the brain. That's okay like this. And from there, I copy and paste the part of the brain there. Someone wants pizza. Look like pizza. And repeat this process with a smaller part in this area. I go on the mask layer, use B to paint in black over 
my selection and hide this part you see the black there show that it is hiding the part of the brain oh I should not remove the selection <coughs> I come back on the layer command C command D and paste it there find and I move the brain right there right there maybe behind the rectangles before I think it's on rectangles rectangles yeah Fine. And then to set back in the, uh, in the same line. Yeah, that's it. Okay. I will save my file by Command S, and you see saving there. And you can see. It as of there at zero percent, so I will come back and it's done. Now that the file is saved, I'll continue the poster. And let's see what happens. If I click, no, no shadow. It's bad. Uh, it already looks uh, looks not that bad. Huh? It already looks not bad. Hmm. Now the difficult part is coming. What can I add? or remove what a good question that's too much but the 16 in yellow can be a good id as well as the first letter of the title and this one too the t of process Mental process. Yeah. No? No. Yeah, I think it looks uh, pretty good like that. Huh? See you tomorrow for the poster 618. Okay. Thank you to follow along this short tutorial. And uh, take good care of yourself. Stay healthy. Continue learning. See you tomorrow. Goodbye.